Welcome to WOW TV for Kids. Today I want to show you some fun activities on surface tension and water molecules that you can do at home. Here on the screen you will see all of the supplies you will need. First, put your glass on your tray and fill it with as much water as you can without it spilling over. Use the eyedropper to keep adding the last few drops of water so it's as full as you can possibly get it. Estimate or make a prediction of how many paper clips you think will fit into the glass before the water overflows. Will it be one or two? Will it be 20? Will it be even more than that? After you've made your prediction, begin dropping the paper clips in one at a time. Keep count of how many you can get in there before the water begins to spill over. What do you notice at the top of the water? Do you see the surface of the water bulge a little bit or form a dome shape? Drops of water actually stick to each other. This is called surface tension. Surface tension is the bond that holds water molecules together. Once too many paper clips were added to the cup, the surface tension was broken, allowing the water to spill over. How did you do on your prediction? Let's move on to our next activity. Move the glass and wipe off your tray so it's dry. Lay a piece of wax paper onto the tray and use your eyedropper to place a few drops of water onto the wax paper. Try some small drops and then make some really big ones. Check out those drops. What do you notice? What shape does it take? Do you see the dome that we were talking about? That's the water molecules sticking together and attaching themselves to one another. If you have some other liquids to test, place some drops near the water drops on the wax paper. Look closely at the other liquids. Compare the other drops to the water. How are they the same? How are they different? What would happen if we tried to separate the droplet? Try poking that drop with a clean toothpick. What happens? Try poking the other liquids with a dry and clean toothpick. What happens there? Now, poke the water drop with a toothpick that has been dipped into a little bit of dish soap. See a difference? Why do you think this happened? When soap is added to the water, the molecules of the soap decreases the water's surface tension, causing it to spread out and break the surface tension. I hope you've had fun with these activities and learned a little something about surface tension and water molecules. If your parent wants to share a picture of you doing these activities, please post them on Facebook or Twitter with the hashtag WowTV for Kids. Thanks for joining me. I'll see you next time.